had conversations, very positive conversations, where they technically said, okay, let's meet soon. Hey guys, welcome back on the channel, Fabrizio here, as always, to keep you posted on all the transfer market news today. I want to touch on Leo Messi. I'm receiving many questions on Leo Messi, Alilal, what's going on, all these rumors coming from Saudi Arabia, so let's jump into it together. And guys, we know how crazy all the rumors are going around Leo Messi because officially it's January and so Leo Messi is potentially a free agent in the summer. Officially Leo Messi can sign with any club now and so it's normal to have many rumors, many stories around the world because it's Leo Messi, uh, it's an historical moment for him, he won the World Cup so it's probably the best moment of his life also on a personal side and not just professional side after writing history with Barcelona of course for many years but winning the World Cup with Argentina is something that will stay forever and so Leo is obviously really happy, very relaxed at the moment I wanted to clarify something on his future because after Cristiano Ronaldo joining Al Nasr, we have many stories on important players uh, attracted by a possible move to Saudi Arabia. And we also had stories about Leo Messi and Al Hilal. I can tell you behind the scenes that Al Hilal are the other club who approached Cristiano Ronaldo together with Al Nasr in July and also in the past few months. But they don't have any possibility to sign players in January and this is why they were not concrete in the race to sign Ronaldo for this transfer window. So the player always wanted Al Nasr as a priority and so there was not a doubt for Cristiano. But Al Hilal have always been on the market for important players to bring to Saudi Arabia. And so what I wanted to say is that about these links between Leo Messi and Dalilal, I was checking also today, and what I'm told is very clear. As of today, as of now, Leo Messi has not received any kind of proposal or approach from Alilal. So there is not a negotiation between Messi and Alilal, there is not, there is not a bid on the table, uh, there is nothing to be tempted. I see these rumors of the best bid, better than Ronaldo about the salary for Leo Messi or this kind of stories. Messi, his team, his father Jorge, so the whole Messi camp is not aware of anything about the potential move to Alilal. The only way for Leo Messi is called, as of today, Paris Saint-Germain. I told you in December that Paris Saint-Germain and Leo Messi have a verbal pact to continue together. What does it mean? That at the end of the World Cup, uh, right before the final, Messi and PSG had conversations, very positive conversations, where they technically said, OK, let's meet soon so we will have the chance to extend the contract because Messi said, I want to stay in Paris and PSG told him, we want you to stay at all costs. They already told him before the World Cup, imagine during and after the World Cup, of course they want Messi to stay. And Messi wants the same, Messi wants to continue in Paris. So that was a very positive feeling, but they need to prepare the contract. What I can tell you today is that there is a meeting prepared between Messi and PSG. This meeting will take place in the next days, weeks, they are still scheduling the day, but the meeting will take place between Messi and PSG to prepare the contract and then, following steps of course, it will take some time to sign the new contract for Leo Messi with PSG. We have just to understand how long will be his contract, because at the moment Messi is still deciding to get it with his family, with his father and all the people close to him, so let's see if it's going to be one year contract with an option for the second year, let's see if it's going to be a two year deal, so it's on Leo Messi now for sure, but the conversation will take place with a direct meeting and it's about the length of the contract, some details on the contract salary and then Leo Messi will be prepared to extend his contract with PSG. Also, wanted to clarify that Messi has not received any kind of official bid from Barcelona, so I know there are always rumors about Barca, but now it's January and Messi was never approached by Barcelona, like saying, okay, do you want to return, here is your bid. This didn't happen, from what I'm told, and also Inter Miami, of course, they would love to bring Leo Messi to you, uh, MLS, but they were never in the process to sign Messi. His priority is Paris Saint-Germain. Inter Miami dream of Leo Messi, Inter Miami made very clear that they want Leo Messi in the future, but at the moment is not something that uh, we can say advanced for now. For the future, we will see, but at the moment, Alilal, no bid, Inter Miami, nothing advanced for this year, and also for Barcelona at the moment. The big dream is not in the facts with a concrete proposal. PSG and Leo Messi prepared to continue together. The here we go is expected soon. And so guys, let me hear your thoughts about Leo Messi future. Alilal, PSG, Barca, many things mentioned, but PSG is the future of Leo Messi. So I wait for your opinion. Do you think this is the best way for Leo Messi? Or maybe you wanted him to 
Alilal to compete with Ronaldo, or maybe to Barcelona, the fantastic return of Messi to Barca, or maybe to MLS with Inter Miami. I wait for your opinion. Hit in the comments, let me know your ideas. As always, guys, subscribe to the channel, like this video, turn on the notification bell, and see you soon. Yeah.